Welcome back to Fusion 306 tutorial. In this video, we'll solve this exercise in the Fusion 360. So open your Fusion and let's go. You can download this sketch in the comments and the description of this video in the community. So let's go. First, go to create a sketch, select the top plane, select the line. Click here in the midpoint, make a line here with 60 millimeters. Make this sketch here, okay? Go to sketch dimension, the angle here, 85 degrees. The angle here is 70 degrees. And the distance between these two lines here is eight millimeters. We have this, finish the sketch. Go to extrude, extrude this 50 millimeters. Press okay. Now go to create a sketch, select the front plane. Select line, make the sketch here. Okay, the distance here is 10 millimeters, and the distance here, 8 millimeters. Finish the sketch, go to extrude, select this profile here. The extended type, all, operation cut, press OK. We make this cut here. Okay. Now go to create, select this face here, this plane, and here select the 3D sketch, select line, click here and, and this point here, make a line here with 50 millimeters. Go to constraint, select coincident, select this point here and this edge, okay. Select the line again, make the same here in the other side. Select this point. This line has 50 millimeters. Go to constraint, select coincident, select this point and this edge here. Okay. Now select the line again. Click here in this point. Make a line here with 20 millimeters. And make a line here with 20 millimeters too. Okay. Go to constraint, select coincident, select this point and this edge, this point and this edge. We have this, okay. Now, go to create, select a point, make a point here. Select a line, construction line. Make a line between this point and this point. Between these two points, between these two points here. Okay, we have this. Now here, go to constraint, select the echo, make all this construction line echo. Okay. Finish the sketch, go to construct and select it plane through three points. Select this, this point here, this point here, and this point here, and press OK. We have this. Go to create a sketch, select this plane here, select the line, remove the 3D sketch here, okay. Make a line here, okay. Go to constraints and select the midpoint, select this line and this point here. Go to create, select the arc, center point arc, click here in the midpoint and this point here, make an arc here. Okay, go to constraint, select the coincident, select this arc and this point here. And press OK. Now go to revolve. This is the profile. The axis is this line here. Operation cut, press OK. We make this. Okay. Now press letter A in the keyboard. And let me select the point here, select any point here, okay? Select here face, select this face, point this face. Here it uh, uh, orange color here, press OK. Now go to create a sketch, select the front plane, select the 3D sketch here, select the line, click here in this point, make a line here with 20 millimeters. Go to constraint, coincident, select this point and this edge here. Select a line, make a line here with 50 millimeters. 
okay select constraint coincident select this point in this edge here now select the line here select this point here make a line here with 19 millimeters go to constraint select coincident select this point in this edge we have this okay okay now go to create select the point make a point here okay select the line construction line type make a line between this sorry make a line between this point here and this point and this two point here and between this two point okay we have this now go to constraint select equal make all this line equal okay go to sketch dimension the distance here the length of this line is 50 millimeters press ok we have this finish the sketch go to construct and select the plane through three points select this point this point here and this point here and press ok we have this plane here now go to create a sketch select this new plane here select the line make a line here remove the 3d sketch here make a line here sorry okay go to constraint select the midpoint go to dimension the distance here 100 millimeters go to create arc center point arc click here in this point in this point here make an arc here okay finish the sketch go to revolve the axis is this axis here operation cut and press ok we have this press letter a in the keyboard and select the faces here select this face sorry select the yellow color here okay we can hide the sketch 5 we have this okay now go to modify select the shell select this face here the inside thickness here is four millimeters and press okay we have this now go to create a sketch select this face here go to create sorry modify select the offset select this add here eight millimeters offset press ok finish the sketch go to extrude select this profile here minus four millimeters né? operation cut and press ok we have this Press letter A in the keyboard, select this face here, paint it red, select the red color, okay, we have this. Now let's check the, the, the question and the answers, okay. The first question here, what is the area of yellow area in the picture? The yellow area here the answer here so let's check this go to inspect measure select this face here this area okay the answer here okay now uh, the area of the orange surface so let's inspect this let's check this it's correct okay now the question three the area of the red surface select this surface here let's check the the answer that's correct okay and the last question the volume of the model so to see the volume 
open here the, the bodies, okay? Open here, click with the right button, and go, and go to properties. And here the volume, okay? The same answer. So here we finish our exercise. So thanks for watching. Subscribe my channel for more and bye bye.